Star power, that's a phrase you'll hear a lot of these students use. Girls on the Run is teaching the next generation about confidence, teamwork, and leadership, not just to improve their physical health, but also their mental health. Girls on the Run is so much fun. When you hear this chant, Girls on the Run is so much fun. And see these warm-ups. You know the girls We're getting ready to take a lap around the track. are on the run. We um, motivate other people and, and they um, motivate us. Hop, hop, hop. These Chesterfield Elementary School students partake in Girls on the Run Greater Richmond. It's a youth development program based in schools and community sites that includes weekly practices and culminates with the 5K. But these young athletes learn about so much more than just physical fitness. I love that we learn about friendship. Through the curriculum, Amelda and Sophia, now running mates and good friends, form bonds and build confidence, or star power as they call it. Star power is when you, when you like, when you, um, believe in yourself. We see a lot of need for girls to grow their confidence. Board chair Carrie Bartlett says mental health for boys and girls remains about equal during childhood, but when girls approach their teenage years, they face extra challenges. Girls, self-confidence, self-esteem, um, how they feel about themselves, it really takes a huge hit as they go into adolescence. That's where coaches like Sharika Scales come in. It's kind of like we became a little family. The Bensley Elementary counselor knows the importance of training the body and the brain. How would it make you feel? Uh, disappointment. One way of doing that, conflict resolution exercises. We um, present scenarios to the students and we give examples um, and then we allow them to work it out. Such as, what would you do if a friend talks behind your back? I will say, do not do that ever again. All of it from the counseling to the exercising, leveling up star power for these girls on the run. My parents have taken me to like really fun places, um, though I'd rather be here, I'd rather be here than over there. No place else she would rather be. Now that program for the spring will begin on Monday and it all leads up to that 5K right here at City Stadium. If you're interested about registration, we have information on WTVR.com. Now coming up all new at six, how these girls are also rebuilding skills that may have been lost during the pandemic. Working for you, I'm Tyler Lane, CBS 6 News.